Well, a very warm welcome to you on this most pleasantly clear evening. Conditions absolutely beautiful. Perfect for the beautiful shoes, are kind as well. No doubt playing a hand in high attendance levels as well as an elevated level of anticipation here. Surely this is the hot ticket going around in this neck of the woods. It surely must be. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. The lineup we have suggests it's going to be a 4 5 1 formation, Jim. Well, most teams that use this system, Peter, will work it in a, a way where, yes, they'll have a 4 5 1 shape off the ball and ideally a, a 4 3 3 shape on it. We often see that 4 1 4 1 shape too. And that has an obvious flexibility about it. It's a, it's a popular managerial selection because of that. It's just extremely flexible with all the numbers I've mentioned. And we're underway. work on the right flank now what's next it's being played forward uh, ball needed to be better there it's a wasted chance Vasco da Gama have made it clear what they're trying to do for me Peter what are they trying to do well I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into into better supply routes receives it from best Hoists it forward, cuts it out. Goes long. Dangerous looking ball, and it's come to nothing. Challenge, he just stood firm. Elias. Is there any support? He might not need it. And out to safety. Atletico Mineiro get it back again. That is an adventurous run down the left-hand side. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. Elias. Back into the middle. Ball's come loose, and the chase is on. And that's sprayed out wide. Oh, that's neat. Room for a shot. Plays it back. Oh, he certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. Shoots! Good effort, and it is right on half-time. Atletico Mineiro got as close as close can be, right on the whistle, but it was not to be. That's the first half compared with your expectation. Unspectacular, but solid, and that solidity could yet be the foundation for them to, to go on and win. So they head in, no further forward. The score here, still 0-0. We are already promptly back underway. Atletico Mineiro 
playing well with lots of opportunities and plenty positives to take from the first half despite this scoreline converting chances would make a world of difference for them that's good intervention things could have got far worse than that with style the breakthrough arrives at last great corner and he did the rest well as contact goes that was tremendous and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net I think when it comes to the aerial department this fella is definitely no sledge Vasco da Gama, break the deadlock. Oh, half-time has been a blessing for this team. You know, what a great start to the second half. Held by a goal, needing to go up a gear. That's how it looks here. Floats one over. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. No, it's just about the sum of it, isn't it, Jim? Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Could move up a gear here. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, Peter, his body shape was a giveaway before he made the pass, and its obviousness was, was appreciated. Has he found his man? It's a long ball, but it's not hit its target. Atletico Mineiro are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. He's having a look round. It's a fine run and he's happy to keep going. So who's he picking out? They've been caught out here. A chance to play it in. Going for goal! The whistle has gone and it is all over. Always in the balance and in the end one goal was enough. They are narrowly beaten. Look, I think a draw might have been a much fairer result today. It's just that 